What type of thrift store Pikachu? What is, what is, no, what happened? You know what, you need to get it together. You need to seek help. Go outside, go to a park, talk to a woman. All right, what's up guys? So according to the title of this video, you probably know the sins I'm about to commit today. It didn't feel like enough just roasting you guys. So I got my top supporters, my patrons, but these are the people who make everything that I do possible. And I'm so thankful for them. I've got these beautiful people to put their work into this channel in our discord server. And uh, I'm just gonna destroy them. <laughs> I mean, that's the only logical thing to do, right? These people support everything I do. They feed my village, they feed me, they make all this possible. So let's do it. Let's lose some patrons today <clears throat> all right so first up first victim we've got a uh this this is actually a victim this is a sunburn victim what happened uh the sunburn aside the hair i would like to see a little bit more of a silhouette i would like to see some loose strands just to break that shape because right now you know it, i don't know what that is like a cutting board behind her head like something <laughs> It's solid, get it together. Oh, look at this, a, a, pr a pretty boy. I almost find this line art a little bit too thick and distracting, but I guess if that's your art style, uh, you do you. I'm not going to, you know, try to change who you are. We just probably can't be friends. The this is the fourth post. <laughs> What's going on with the anatomy here? Is, are these supposed to be the ribs? Uh, the and don't even get me started on his shoulder. It looks like a butt cheek. Would don't let me see this again. Don't let me see this again. Oh no, what happened? Look, I don't know what you were going for, but she looks like a mushroom. Look at this font too. Oh, you definitely squished this image. Why did you do that? You know, I would say that this is a face that no mother could love, but to be honest with you, I don't even think he had a mother. He was probably spawned straight from hell and just uh, popped into this world like, oh my. Oh my. Okay, so I know my audience. Uh, I know you guys are a bunch of thirsty individuals. Yes, I am looking at you. Uh, so we're, let's just talk about it, okay? These are way too high up. They look like pecs. And also the hand. Like, give me some effort, please. Try. <laughs> oh, what a beautifully stylized, illustrative portrait. Uh, and then you got too lazy to do the legs, so you call it a mermaid, huh? I'm watching you. Mildly disturbing, but uh, I, the, the rendering on this eyeball is fantastic. Really nicely done. It's, it's so nice and spherical and the uh, shine, the shine on the eyeball. Though this is not new, but roast the hell out of me, please. Very, very good attention to detail. This was like a, like an actual splash art piece. The only thing, I would try to be a little bit more conscious of the direction of the trees in the background because they seem almost random right now. And I would honestly like to see them kind of placed in a way that brings your eyes into the center of the piece onto the focal point which is the character but that's like a little bit more advanced stuff when it comes to compositions and i don't think your brain is advanced enough to understand that just yet but um you know just leaving that out there for you very proud of this piece <laughs> you are you are you now <laughs> Her head is tiny. Do better. And bro, speaking of heads, look at the size of this forehead. I could park a 4x4 here. While we're parking the 4x4, you might as well apply a little bit of sunscreen because she's burnt. My lord, she looks so unimpressed. She looks so unimpressed. Could she be looking at your drawing process? <laughs> Okay, if you're doing a painterly style, you want a little bit more clarity at the focal point. So the focal point here would be her creepy face. I would love to see a bit more definition in the face, a bit more sharpness, just a little bit more readability. And while you do that, go seek help because this is very disturbing. And this is a cool portrait, but you know what? Give me a little bit more hair. I want to feel the texture of that hair. I want to see the strands. Next time you draw hair, I want it to be so hair-like that when you put your face up to your iPad, you can feel the hair tickling your nose, okay? <laughs> Oh, look at this. Great job on the skin. Great job on the jewelry and the shininess of everything. That's fantastic. But you just, <laughs> you thought I wasn't going to notice this, huh? What happened? Why does she have a velociraptor claw? <laughs> Ooh, cute. She's smiling a little bit awkwardly. I don't know if that's what you were going for. And she feels like she's like, What is this? Mm, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. I claim no negative energy. Oh, lovely, lovely, lovely. The only thing throwing me off a little bit are these horns. Because you use the skin tone color with these reds mixed into it, it almost looks like it's made of meat and it's squishy and soft. Don't make me bring out that image of Master Wugwe again because we keep drawing our girls like Master Wugwe. I don't know why. Come on, guys. The neck is not this long. Oh, we got a video here. Oh, ooh. ooh, look at that kick. Oh, whoa, oh, 
Oh, this is what I'm doing to you guys right now. <laughs> okay, the rendering on this portrait is impeccable. But you know what's kind of bothering me is I might be nitpicking here, but this part with the lit cigar, look at the way it's all pixelated and weird looking. It reminds me of something from Microsoft Paint. Oh my lord. It seems as though she's kind of like bloated on the side, so uh, that might be something you want to look at. This hand here, it's kind of blending into itself and it looks almost like a foot. No, not even a foot. It looks like a chicken foot. Ooh, yeah, look at that, ooh. Beautiful lighting. Like if he were to straighten all his fingers out, uh, that ring finger would be about twice the length of everything else. I mean like, boy, what that, what that ring finger do? That could get out of here. Seek professional help. That Lady Gaga. This is the thing I like to do, okay? When I look at hair on a character, I look through it. I try to look for the, the skull. I try to be like, what would this character look like if they were bald, okay? Just think about that. What would they look like if they were bald? And then you slide that image, that bald image, right under the hair and see if it actually fits. If it does, it's good. If, if not, okay, she's, Yep, okay, and she's got a weapon with blood on it. I don't know if I should be scared or, uh, yeah. mm. Okay, are you trying to be creepy? Are you trying to be creepy? Like, why are so many artists so disturbed? Why? Come on, guys. Be more like this guy, okay? Look at the sun and smile, please. Ooh, love the style here. She's so, she's a uh, great expression. I feel like this looks like something I've done before too. I see a lot of me and you, my, my young child. Well done. Hmm, what's going on here? She looks like she's, uh, she looks like she's about to fart. Oh yeah. Uh. <laughs> Yo, chill, man, put that down. Yo. All right here, so, um, I'm pretty sure the buttocks on the human uh, figures are not this big. Uh, pretty sure they don't extend out like this. Uh, this seems a little bit wide. This looks like the uh, Squidward after he ate all the Krabby Patties. Uh, before you go type in the comments, I'm just joking. I know it's a dress. Come on now. Am I, am I stupid or, or, or are you stupid? Yeah, obviously not me, so it's gotta be you. What is that? You get this off my screen, you dirty, thirsty. You, where are his lats, dude? Like, uh, d take yourself, okay, take your butt, g get off your chair, go to the gym, okay? D do this, okay, do this pose in the mirror. Take a picture of yourself, okay? You can see the whole lat, you can see the uh, little wings on the abs. The pec is not going to extend all the way down. Please get it together, get your anatomy together before you start drawing naked men with weird, fuzzy brush strokes in suspicious places. All right, okay, slightly disturbed, slightly disturbed. Uh, good to know that he doesn't have a brain. <laughs> good job, very good job, uh, Dora. Very good job, Dora. Keep exploring. No, oh my God, this poor guy's hairline. You gave him a whole airport runway. Okay, sir, look here, or, or don't look here because you're looking in two different directions. So if you're drawing a character like this, I highly recommend you cover up uh, both of the eyes to see if they're actually looking in the same direction and not just like going full chameleon mode. My goodness, what is this? What is this? What type of thrift store Pikachu? What is, what is, oh, how cute. Oh my God, speaking of cute, this is anything but cute. Um, Is this her Adam's apple? Is this her butt? Okay, <laughs> I don't wanna ask. All right, all right, all right, you thirsty individuals, all right. Full screen this for you guys, okay? Yeah. You enjoy that, yeah? I'm gonna just move on real quick before you whip it out. Oh my God, and I thought I had a big chin. Jesus Christ. What a beautiful scene. Look at this girl, so strong. She is so strong. Someone broke her whole leg and she's still standing. You've managed to make her head even bigger than it already was. Why are you crying in tears? What is that? Sketchbook. Oh, she's crying into her sketchbook. Okay, you know what? <laughs> Relatable content. Well, look at this stylization. Wow. Look at this little piece blowing in the wind. Just, I, I wanna see even more of that. I wanna see like just flowing. I wanna see things like blowing in the wind. I wanna see chaos and, and fire and death. Okay, so um, what is going on in the background here? Why does, this, why does this kid have a rocket? I'm not gonna question it. I'm not gonna question it. <clears throat> All right, great drawing. I'm assuming this is a study. The skin looks fantastic. Okay, give, give me a streak of highlight on the hair. Let me see some natural oils. Let me see some healthy growth. It's Sid. 
Sid the Sloth. Oh my god. <laughs> Next, this is your all time favorite piece. Okay, let me just, where do I start? You got a full cranium in there, which looks great. There's a, a great flow from the forehead down to the nose. But what's going on with this uh, trap muscle right there? Why is it connecting at that angle? Is she just like really jacked? Is she, the, look, the trap is that big? Why does her arm continue like this and then turn into a black shape right here and just end? Where's, where did her hand go? Hmm? I feel like you were running away from your hand responsibilities, but you know what? I'll wait, you can explain it to me, I'll wait. Oh, look at her, standing like an NPC. The expression and the position of the camera, everything looks kind of sus. Oh my God, what is this? What is this? Why do I look pretty? Why do I look pretty? So if we're all looking at it, let's just talk about it. The light and the shadow. Well, on a round and smooth surface, if there is a light transitioning to dark, you're gonna get a softer blend from the light to the dark. It's not a hard edge. Transition is gonna follow the shape of that object. So this needs to be blended out. So I want you to go back in there and blend that out. I'm sure you wouldn't mind working on that again. I can tell you put a lot of effort into it. So this is a self portrait. Uh, I'm sure you meant to give yourself like lightning coming out of your eyes, but right now they look like tree branches. Classic mistake here. If you cover everything else on this painting and just look at this eye, it's actually a front view of the eye. So you've basically put a front view eye onto a side view portrait. And if you ever look at this piece and you're like, why does it look kind of off? That's probably the reason why. I don't know about you, but when I take baths, I, I like to not wear any clothes. Maybe you work on that next time. Ew. Oh my God, this is, this kind of scary. Oh, oh. These, these just get more and more disturbing. Oh, oh no. What happened? You know what, this this should be in the PSA. Don't do drugs, kids, or you're gonna end up like this. Ex exactly like this. Oh, this is so pretty, I really like that. I love the lighting here. Man, look at the shadow on the fingers. Oh my God, the fingers, the shadow, fin the finger shadow is on the butterfly. Mmm, <laughs> that's good, that's good. That's that good stuff. Yeah, that's the good stuff. Oh, this is so cute, I love this. I love this, this is so good. Oh, look at that. You know what, next time, maybe include uh, the facial features, yeah? Maybe maybe do that instead of running from your responsibilities. And is this the sun or the moon? Because if somehow the sun were to be this big in our sky, it would have to be really close to the earth. And as a result of that, everything on earth would be uh, incinerated. We would burn and we would die. She would not be having this moment right now. Okay, uh, roast me, Sam. Yeah, no, I, I, I'm going to. I am going to with with a drawing like this. Here, here's the head. Okay, head looks good, looks normal, and then you you come out to the shoulder. What happened? It's like you chopped her arms off. It's so narrow. Wow, wow. I can't believe my community has been infiltrated by. Uh, <laughs> is that a, like a? Is this a pony? Ew. Ooh. Ew. 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 What is this? What? What is this? What is this? What is this? What is that? You know what? You need to get it together. You need to seek help. Go outside. Go to a park. Talk to a woman. Oh my God. I'm. You know what? This looks like an NFT. Those NFT bros, they would eat this up. They'd be like, yo, dude, this is so sick. Yo. Oh, look at this. Oh, this is great. Look at this chunky boy. <laughs> I like that. Ooh, okay, this is your OC. All right. Um, this eye right here is actually a little bit lower than the other eye. You might want to check that out, you know. They're a little bit uneven right now, but uh, not only that, the main thing I want to point out is the size of this cranium. It's kind of uh, massive, kind of massive. She looks like an alien. She looks like she's got, something's going on underneath that hair that I don't really like. Uh, yeah, no, the face looks great. The shapes here look really good. Um, is, is this supposed to be a bucket hat? Because it looks nothing like a bucket hat. Like the back doesn't even flare out. What is she wearing? Is this like a mix between a beanie and a bucket hat? I mean, is this a new trend that I don't know about? A beanie and a bucket hat mixed together into one? I don't think it should be because it's, it's not flattering. Oh man, why are you sad? Don't be sad. 
she's probably looking at all the artworks being submitted into this channel. It's okay. These people are trying their best. All right, there we go. That about does it for me roasting the art of my top patrons, my top supporters. I'm probably going to lose a few patrons after this, but uh, you know what? For the entertainment of the people, it was worth it. Once again, this is just for entertainment, so don't take anything I say too seriously. If you have a tendency to do that, please learn how to have fun in life. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hopefully uh, along the way you learned something new, or if not, I hope you were just thoroughly entertained in seeing these people's careers get ended. Isn't that funny? Like they are my top supporters. They're there for me every step of the way, and this is how I repay them. Honestly, I don't even know why you guys like me, so I'm just gonna keep doing this until one day you guys realize you don't like me anymore. If you guys wanna be a part of video, Videos like this head over to our patreon and join our discord server we do tutorials and process videos and all that fun stuff and i chat with people there every once in a while and if you want to see more art content feel free to subscribe to my channel with that being said i'll see you guys on the next video me and my child me and my child me and my burb so i don't think i held back as much as i normally do in this video if you guys like that if you guys enjoy the uh violence let me know and we can do more like this. But if you guys want me to be a little bit more gentle with the roasting, I can do that too. Just, just let me know. Anyways, now that all the fake fans have left this video, uh, I love you guys. See you next time.